If you love the clean, minimalist design of Google's Pixel phones, you're likely familiar with the Material U interface, which adapts colors to match your wallpaper for a cohesive look. Now, you can bring that same Pixel-inspired aesthetic to your Windows 11 desktop by following our step-by-step -step guide. Today, we'll show you how to set up customizable widgets like clocks and weather, which give your desktop a clean, personalized feel. So, let's get started. The first and most important step to transforming your Windows 11 desktop is installing RainMeter. RainMeter is a highly customizable desktop widget tool that lets you add skins, widgets, and other customization features. It's widely used by people looking to modify the way their Windows desktop looks and functions. To begin, head to the RainMeter website, download the latest version of the tool, and install it on your system. During the installation process, you can choose between the standard installation or a portable version if you don't want it permanently installed on your system. Once RainMeter is installed, make sure it's running by checking the system tray at the bottom right corner of your screen. RainMeter will be the engine that runs the Pixel UI skins on your desktop, so having it up and running is essential before proceeding. Now that you've got RainMeter installed, it's time to bring in the Pixel UI. A developer has created a theme called MD3 that replicates the Material U widgets and other design elements seen on Pixel phones. This skin brings together widgets like clocks, weather, battery monitors, and system controls, all styled to look like they're part of Google's Material U interface. To download the MD3 skin, go to the GitHub page of the developer who created it. You can find it by simply searching for MD3 RainMeter skin on your favorite search engine, or you can go directly to GitHub if you have the link. Once you've found it, download the skin in a zip format. When the download is complete, you'll need to extract the zip file. Right-click on the file and select Extract All, then navigate to the folder where the skin was extracted. You should see several files related to the MD3 theme, including the main.rm skin file, which is what we will use to install the skin into RainMeter. With the MD3 skin downloaded and extracted, you're now ready to install it. Installing skins in RainMeter is easy. All you need to do is double-click the .armaskin file you extracted earlier. This will open the RainMeter skin installer, and you'll be able to see all the widgets that come with the MD3 skin. Before you hit install, make sure all the widgets are selected in the installer. Once that's done, click install, and RainMeter will automatically apply the MD3 skin to your desktop you'll immediately notice the changes as widgets begin appearing on your desktop, styled in the Material U fashion. Now that the MD3 skin is installed, it's time to customize it to make sure everything looks and functions the way you want. One of the best things about RainMeter and the MD3 skin is that they're incredibly customizable. You can choose where to place your widgets, how they look, and how they behave. Start by exploring the widgets that were added to your desktop. You'll likely see a taskbar, clock, and perhaps a few other widgets like a weather widget or music player. To move these widgets around, simply click and drag them to your preferred location on the screen. For example, if you prefer a centered clock widget, drag it to the middle of your desktop. Similarly, if you want to place the weather widget in the corner, just drag it over there. The idea is to make the interface not only beautiful, but also functional and easy for your everyday use. For the taskbar, RainMeter will allow you to hide the default Windows taskbar and use the custom pixel-style taskbar that comes with the MD3 skin. To do this, right-click on the Windows taskbar, go to Taskbar Settings, and enable Automatically Hide the Taskbar. This will allow the RainMeter taskbar to take over, providing that clean, minimalistic look that you find on Pixel devices. One of the standout features of Material U on Google Pixel phones is how it adapts the color scheme of the interface to match the wallpaper. You can replicate this on Windows by customizing the color scheme of your MD3 widgets. To match the colors of your Pixel UI with your wallpaper, right-click on any of the widgets and go to Variants. Here, you can choose between different color variants, such as dark or light, depending on your preference. You can also adjust specific colors if you want even more control over the look of your desktop. 
For the best results, consider switching your entire Windows 11 system theme to dark mode. To do this, go to Settings, then Personalization, then Colors, and under Choose Your Color, select Dark. This ensures that the MD3 skin integrates flawlessly with the rest of your system, providing that cohesive, pixel-inspired aesthetic. The MD3 skin comes with a variety of widgets, but if you want to add more, there are additional options available. You can download extra widgets from RainMeter's official website or explore third-party sites that offer skins compatible with RainMeter. Some additional widgets you might find useful include system monitors, weather widgets for multiple locations, music players, and more. All of these can be customized to fit your Pixel UI theme, which enhances both the functionality and aesthetics of your desktop. Adding a weather widget, for instance, can be handy if you frequently check the weather. RainMeter widgets allow you to enter your city and receive real-time weather updates. To configure this, right-click on the weather widget, select Edit Skin, and follow the instructions for adding your city's location. This small touch not only looks great, but is practical for daily use. If you ever decide you no longer need a specific widget or you want to change its appearance, RainMeter makes it easy. To remove a widget, right-click on it and select Unload Skin. This will remove the widget from your desktop without affecting the rest of the setup. Alternatively, you can modify existing widgets by editing the skin settings. Right-click on the widget, select Edit Skin, and you'll be taken to a notepad file where you can make changes to how the widget behaves. This is where you can get creative by changing fonts, adjusting sizes, or even adding new functionality to the widget. One final tip for getting the most out of your Pixel UI setup on Windows 11 is to keep everything updated. RainMeter frequently releases updates to its software, which improves performance and adds new features. Likewise, the developers of the MD3 skin may release new versions with additional customization options or bug fixes. To ensure everything runs smoothly, check for updates every so often. In RainMeter, you can do this by right-clicking on the RainMeter icon in the system tray and selecting Check for Updates. For the MD3 skin, you'll need to revisit the developer's GitHub page and see if a newer version has been released. By now, you've probably noticed how much more visually appealing and functional your Windows 11 desktop has become. The Pixel UI setup doesn't just look good. It also helps you be more productive by organizing essential tools like clocks, calendars, and system monitors in one place. This is especially beneficial for people who spend a lot of time on their computers and want quick access to important information. Beyond the aesthetics, using a customized UI can actually improve your workflow. For instance, having a music player widget on your desktop allows you to control your media without needing to open a separate app. Similarly, Having a real-time weather widget can save you the trouble of checking your phone or browser every time you want an update. Installing Pixel UI on Windows 11 using RainMeter and the MD3 skin is an exciting way to personalize your desktop. It not only mimics the clean, adaptive look of Google's material, you but also provides a functional, customizable workspace that adapts to your preferences. Whether you're a fan of Pixel's design language or just looking to freshen up your Windows experience, this guide has hopefully shown you how to achieve that with ease.